Hey what's up guys welcome back to our channel technology so today in this video I'm going to show you guys how to fix outlook password problem username and password pop-up problem so you just need to follow me so at first open your outlook on your computer and go to the file and click on add account now you have to click on manual setup additional server types now click on next after that choose here pop and imap now click on next after that you have to do some settings on your gmail so just go to your gmail account and after that click on this right side corner setting button and after that click on settings and you will get this window so after getting this window you have to click on forwarding and pop imap make sure that this option is enable which is enable imap okay after enable click on save changes and now minimize this window after that you have to put your name over there the next one is your email id now you have to select here account type imap now put the incoming server over there imap.gmail.com now on the smtp you have to put the next box to put here smtp.gmail.com now in the password field you have to put your password now what you have to do you need to go to you need to go to the more settings and after that on the outgoing server you have to check this option and now go to the advanced and change the imap port now you have to put here 993 and select here SSL now before click on this outgoing server SMTP make sure that you have selected this one SSL after that you have to put here 587 so if in your case 587 is not working you can try 56465 so I will select here means put here 587 after that click on OK now click on next so now as you can see I'm getting this pop-up so if I will click over there and click on OK I'm getting again and again same pop-up so now what you have to do you need to go to your gmail account simply after that click over there and click on google accounts after that you have to go to the security you have to go to the security over there from the left side corner and now scroll down sorry scroll down and you will get one option over there is called app password so select over there and you will get a page like this so you have to put here your password and after that click on next and now you have to select here mail and from select device you have to select here uh, windows computer now click on generate after that you will get a password like this so you have to copy this password and you have to put over there and now click on save this password in your password list now click on ok and let's see it's working or not so as you can see it's completed successfully so now close this window and click on and click on next click on finish now as you can see my email is working over there so as you can see the email is coming so i hope this small video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any queries or questions then comments down below i will see you guys on the next one next video take care